Now we move on to WrestleMania 16 from 2000, which the theme of the show was a McMahon in every corner for the main event. You had Triple H with Stephanie McMahon. You had The Big Show with Shane McMahon. You had Linda McMahon with Mick Foley. And then you had Vince McMahon with The Rock. Disappointing main event, in my opinion, because you had... Mick Foley come back one month after his so-called retirement and you think maybe he's going to win the title and retire as champion, but nope, he gets eliminated. So his comeback is pretty much rendered useless. He just came back for the one more match and then lost. And then to top it all off, you have the very predictable Vince McMahon turning heel on the rock at the very end of the match. You did have a few highlights on this show. You had a couple of good matches. You had the the three-way ladder match between the Hardys, the Hardys, the Dudleys, and Edge and Christian. And you had Kurt Angle losing both of his titles. Um, so yeah, this WrestleMania had a few highlights, but then it had some, some forgettable matches as, as well. It was a very mixed bag for that year. And Report Card Radio is like, don't forget TNA versus Head Cheese, bro. Yeah. Um, and I agree. The The triple threat, Chris Benoit, Chris Jericho, and Kurt Angle uh, was pretty good stuff. But everything else I felt was was forgettable. 